So we've got this Mario program where sometimes he's able to double jump, sometimes not. So let's pause and try to go through that sequence of events. So we can see him something weird happening here. Um, and then the previous jump, not. Um, and so I set up some watches so we can look at some values in the program. But it'd be really nice if we could actually see where he's been in the past. So uh, we can actually trace Mario and see where he's been over time. So if we look over here, we see him, you can see the y velocity here. He's getting close to zero. He gets to zero and then starts coming down. Here, he's getting close to zero and then skips to six. So something weird is happening there. Um, so maybe it's related to the power of gravity. So if we change it around, weird, at one it messes up again. At 1.5 it messes up. So it looks like factors of one half, the bug shows up. So perhaps there's something about passing the zero that's an issue. So there might be a problem with the jump. Um, so let's look at that again. So when we come here, you're close to zero, and the person is pressing the up button, and they jump again. And in this case, they're not pressing up, and they're able to go through. Um, so something's weird with jump, and if we look at it, are they pressing up, and is his velocity equal to zero? Oh, so that explains why at 0 0.5 you're getting weird behavior that you didn't see otherwise. And we get rid of that. Uh, it looks like we fixed the behavior. So let's see at the other problem numbers. It seems to be working there too.